Mr. Joey Johns. I really hope Big Al's not on duty. <laughs> Is he that bad? <laughs> Put it this way. He's one of about two people in this cross, and that actually scares me. Oh, okay. Open up! Jesus fucking Christ, oh. Joey. Oh. Oh, I'm you, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just standing up there. In the Holy oh. fuck. Oh. My heart. I nearly shot you. Oh, well, you, we, we wouldn't want that. <laughs> no. No, no, Hi, Mr. Want Sheriff. That. Hi, Seth. Oh, Joey. Hi, Joey. Well. Can I call you Joey now? I mean, not really. It's not actually my name. Well, what is actually your name, then? Well, no one really knows that. It's the Wallaby Kid! Uh, so I suppose I'll <laughs> be stuck with calling you Joey then, since that's what you've been legally recognized as. I mean, as. if you like calling me something, I'm not. Well, I mean, you could remedy that by telling me what you actually are called. <laughs> There's only one person knows my name. Who's that? That would be Lucille. Lucille? Is she a yeah. girlfriend or something like that? Uh, you could say that. Has she gotten a visit you out here? I think she's trying to at the moment. I'm hoping they say yes. Hey, I'm hoping so as well. I know it gets lonely in here. It's terribly lonely in places like this. Hey. Yeah. You mean Big L's not enough company? No, he, he, he smells like, like, like old. He smells like an old man. Speaking of which, how are you doing, Sheriff? I'm recovering. Shudder. You're looking good. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. <clears throat> you, the uh, stripes don't suit you, I have to say. Yeah, I know. Well, I'm hoping that it's not for too much longer. All right. Um, all right, Joey, I'm going to give you a quick rundown um, for Miss Afro. Not here. Joey. Hey, just call me Kid. All right, Kid. I'm gonna give you a quick rundown of what's happening. Um, due to these visits that go on in here, they're not private. I will be listening to the whole thing. However, I will not be talking or interjecting. All right. I'm, I'm literally fair. a fly on the wall. A big red fly on the wall. <laughs> Something like that. I was yeah, right. polite with him. He took time out of his day to bring me out here. It was quite the ordeal getting a ride out. I am being polite that. to him. I'm just, I like you know, him. I'm just, you know. I like your vest. Oh, thank you. Very snazzy. Yeah, you're welcome. No, I, right, I, I, uh, I appreciate it. Hey, Where how's you want to stand here, Joey? Oh, potatoes? Oh, you know. Yeah, yeah. they're all right. Do you know what? Since you complimented my, my vest, you can have this. Oh, it's me! Yeah. Don't want you, uh, not getting, you know, everything that you need. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. Is there any way you want to do this, Joey? Uh, uh, we, yeah, we can stand over here. Alright. Alright, from here on out, it's your show. Okay. He wants to stand in the gallows. Banks' office. This is, I, I just cleaned this recently, so, you know, just wipe your feet. Wipe your feet! Oh, oh, wipe okay, okay, feet. okay, okay, okay. All right. All right. I had to clean it with my face. Oh. Is that, yeah. Yeah. Is that effective? Yeah, Big L's one of the few people in the uh, cross, and that scares me for that exact reason. <laughs> really scary, but no, trust yeah. me, he is. All right, all right. Mm. So right here. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um. Bish bash bosh. Okay. Well, to start with, uh, if I recall correctly, in the telegram you sent me, you told me that uh, you had been arrested with fifty-one crimes and fourteen thousand dollars and fines. Uh, yeah. I did confirm with the deputy and they said that the $14,000 is about correct, but they said the 51 crimes was not even close. 
So yeah, I actually recounted that, and he, whoever told you that was right, it was fifty nine. Uh, he sounds like it was less than that, but okay. Um. So Joey, hang on, hang on. Hi. Let me just reach in my pocket here. I can read them out to you. I. Uh, sure, sure. Why not? Well, I just I want to make sure that you know the truth. I no, that's what I'm doing is looking for the okay, truth. Okay, good. Well, if they said I was lying. Well, we'll see. Okay, from the top, four counts of hostage taking. Four. One count of assault with a deadly weapon. One count of assault with a deadly weapon against a peace uh, peace officer. One count of fleeing and eluding. Two counts of kidnapping of a public servant. Two counts of obstruction of justice. Five counts of robbery under $250. 13 counts of robbery under $500. Five counts of robbery over $500. One count of brandishing. One count of false report of a crime. One count of kidnapping. Two counts of theft of government property. Two counts of false imprisonment of a public servant one count of escape from custody one count of possession of a moonshine card 15 counts of weapon trafficking and one bank robbery wow uh that's 59 think... in total all right i sort of lost count around 43 so you might be correct there yeah so whoever told you was even close uh, you know mm -hmm. i know uh i'll keep that in mind mm -hmm. Right, uh, Joey, can you tell me about the day that you were you were caught? What happened that day? In your own words? Well, well, I was on the run from the law. Uh, the jig was up, and they knew. And that Marty Malone, he saw my face, and he knew who I was. And um, he, he found me over at Thieves Landing, and I used a hostage to escape. And I made Marty dance again. Did you? Yeah, he, he he put on a little bit of a show in Thieves Landing, in the speakeasy, for all to see. It was quite wonderful. But then I escaped, and then you know a day went by, and I thought it was a smart idea to rob a train. So you went to rob I a train. Dropped... Well, I robbed the Del Lobo first, and <laughs> after I robbed him, the train. The train arrived, and uh -huh. so I untied the Del Lobe. I'm like, you know what? Let's rob this train together, fella. And he agreed. And he's like, yeah, he did. It was exciting. And I said, okay, well, there's two people on the train. There's the conductor, and there's a lady in the back carriage. You get the lady in the back carriage, and I'll get the conductor. Okay. So that's what we did. The train started rolling and I went to go get the conductor and it was going swell. I had his hands up, I took his money, $90, and I took his weapons, you know. I don't want him to, to, to poke me or anything, so I uh -huh. took those two. And then when I went to link back up with the Del Lobo fella, he was on the ground and he was yelling out, put your hands up, it's a robbery, while he was on the ground. And then next thing you know, I had Pavis pointing a gun at my face and Marty Malone behind me with a gun. And uh, then they were able to talk you down and bring you in? Well, yeah, 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 yeah. That's well, how that, they got me. That's well, how they caught the wallaby kid. Part of the story that I've heard from other sources is that you fell off the train. And that's how they, no. they picked you up off the ground. Uh, it's a little hazy. Uh, I don't remember the events going exactly that way, but you oh, know, so perhaps, it's easy. Perhaps you might have hit your head on the whole process. Yeah, well, yeah, I did fall over, but I don't remember falling off the train. Okay. Um, yeah. I'd like to ask you a question that I definitely forgot to ask you last time uh, we had an interview. Wallaby. Why Wallaby? Of a... Everything wallaby that you could kid. have chosen. Aye, why the wallaby kid? Well, when I, well, when I was a kid. Well, I'm still a kid, but I I hop around a lot. I hop around and uh, I can't keep still for more than a second. I get all agitated, so I've always got to move. Mm -hmm. And you know, my brother was the same. He was the older brother, and because I was the little brother, 
They call me a wallaby because wallabies are like a smaller kangaroo. They only come up to your knee. They're really small and adorable. Like me. So they started calling me wallaby. So they, you said, your older brothers? No, I had one older brother, Joey. Wait, so you're using... Is Joey Jones your brother's name and you're using his name? Uh, probably. Uh, next question. Is this... So, I, I know you told me before that you're orphaned. Yeah. Kid. Were you with your brother at least, though? It sounds like you were. Or is this before you got or orphaned? Um... Yeah, yeah, I was with my brother. Is he still around? Oh no, he's... He's, he's back, he's back in Australia. Yeah. Why'd you, why'd you come out here without him? Um... I just, I just wanted to like, you know, I just wanted to see the world, you know. I don't like staying in one place at a time. I just got to keep moving. And I'd been everywhere over there. You know, I wanted to find something new and exciting. But he's coming back over here. And at some point he's going to come back and be with me. He is, he's on his way over. One see, day, yeah. I was going to say that's very odd because I know when I left Scotland, I left because... Everything and everyone that I'd known about or cared about had... Oh, they died. They passed away. My parents were gone. My fiancé died. And I was much like you. I was restless. I couldn't stay still. And I decided to come out here. And I made really bad choices when I first arrived in the States. And thankfully I'm free of that now. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. So that is the hat that, uh, so, so the person going around wearing that hat wasn't someone who was trying to steal your glory like you told me before? No, it was all me. Right, so you weren't telling the truth then? No. What was the point of kidnapping me to lie to me? Because I wanted, you know, a different description of the wallaby kid. I suppose it sort of foiled that when they decided to pull everything from the paper high. Yeah, but there was other things to- I want my name out there. I know what you do. Yeah. I've, a, I've done a lot. I'm breaking records. Well, when I was talking to deputies, they said that other people have definitely done more than you have. I... Yeah, they also said I didn't go- I didn't do 50 uh, crimes, but, you know. Oh, I... They can try to diminish if they like. But I heard the reaction. I'm just trying, to, the get, I'm just trying to get truth. I'm not really trying to diminish or prop up anything. Well, Kevin, no, just... I'm just saying, Big L, he sees every prisoner that walks through these doors. And he told me that I'm the biggest criminal he's seen. Right. That's a quote. <laughs> well, uh, didn't I kind of throw Second hand. Second hand quote. Uh-oh. We'll definitely be putting out something about you being arrested. Yeah. And the fine and the counts. We'll see about that. We'll see see what, what I can What do you include. mean we'll see about that's like the most interesting part? I agree. Don't it's tell me I'm gonna open the paper and all it's gonna be is that I got caught the end. Better not be. Well, we're gonna have to see what the editors want. What well, down what that Malone danced again, by the way. No, I won't be doing that. Why not? It's, it's irrelevant to your arrest. I think it's very relevant. I think what he did was a crime. Right. So the two deputies counts of bad doing, dancing, doing their fella. job as a crime? Okay. No, two counts of bad dancing. Okay. Is that it? I mean, not unless there's anything else you'd like to tell me. Um, what are you planning on doing once you're freed from this place? Oh, I plan on robbing folk. Ah, I'm joking, Sheriff. I'm reformed. I got a bibble, a holy bibble in my pocket. 
So what's the uh, right. scorch mark that was on the ground over there? That wasn't me. I know. I know it looks. I got my bibble in my pocket. I can show you. Your Holy bibble. bibble. Holy my bibble. bibble. Uh, you don't have to prove that to me, Joey. Mm. Well, you know. I just want to make sure I, I, I didn't burn nothing. I'm not a burner. I don't burn things. I'm not a to be honest, I, I don't, but <laughs> To be honest, Arson's the only one that's pretty much missing from that account of uh, crimes. You're not telling You're me that right. he murdered anyone. I didn't murder no one. Are you going to? Kill? No, I'm not a killer. I sure hope I that... saw a few. I saw a few fellas in here earlier, and they were talking about a war. How they're going to war? It was no. one of the dumbest things I've ever heard in my life. I, going to but, war. But, kid, that's the thing, all right? I just, I really hope that you can understand this. As this sort of stuff, it leads to worse things. I've seen it. I've seen it in my own life, in my own past, and. I know because I've been looking into this whole war thing and it started over very silly, very minor things and it's evolved into people getting killed and shot down almost every day. This life That's is going to suck. because everyone takes it. That, this life, kid, is going to suck you in deeper and deeper until you're clawing at the walls trying to escape and you find that you can't. That's because everyone takes it so personal. Why? They do? I don't. Well, I don't even take a personal that that I got fine. caught. I, I know, but you're Robin. You said that you're Robin Outlaws. Yeah. And they're the very sorts of people who take that as a deep insult. And insulted outlaws are not nice people. They're the kind of people who catch people and torture them and murder them. And they don't care that you've never actually hurt anyone. I think I think they're more mad that I made them dance. You you know what the it's so funny watching like Please, these hard criminals wounds, dance. Wounds to pride. Wounds to pride are often the most difficult to to heal because they're not like physical wounds mm. i just <laughs> i just don't want to see you get killed over this kid i do want you to hold on to my telegram number right when you're out you can contact me i won't be helping you yeah. with crimes but if you ever need help to get oh, out I was of the like a cute accomplice i guess that's off the table that's very much off the table well bish bash bosh Well, I, I, I'm glad you came to see me. Hey, I'm sorry, uh, it was such a rush. I would have brought you some chocolate or something. But, uh, oh, that would have been amazing. Sorry, I'm sorry. I would have. That's all right. I hope you got, you know, I, I'm being honest with you. I, I, I'm not lying about anything I told you today. I hope so, because he did lie to me before. No, what he said pretty much lines up with what I have. Yeah. That sounds like it. From uh, the talk that I've been doing to other deputies today as well. <laughs> well, thank you for sharing your story with me, Kat. I hope that uh, yeah. I can learn more one day. Yeah, maybe. Why yeah. you find me and get some coffee or something when you're out, alright? Alright. I'll, I'll let you know. I'll get you your chocolate then as well. I'd like that. I'm going to be in here for a while. Hi, I know. <clears throat> well, um, can I give you a hug? Sure. No kisses this time, though. No kisses. Eh. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Really? Yeah. You stay safe in here, okay? Don't make yeah. me angry. You be safe out there. It's it's dangerous out there too. Right, yes. If anyone gives you trouble here, jo uh, kid, you just let me know. Yeah, just remember, Saf, that nothing bad's gonna happen. Cause I'm the best at what I do. I ain't like anybody else. I just want you to remember that you're not invincible. I know you might feel that way, but everything, everything changes eventually. I'm just afraid that things will become too clear to you when it's too late. Hanging the wallaby kid. Sorry? Are you hanging the wallaby kid? No, we're just having a meeting. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll uh, buzz off. That's, that's not what I meant at all. 
<laughs> We're done, I'm, anyways. Um, I'm getting telegrams from deputies. Perhaps you can tell them before I telegram them. Uh, they think I'm not arrested. And they're telling me to come look after somebody who has been hurt. And I'll deal with it. What's your name? Uh, Felix de Leon. I'll deal with it. Okay, gracias. All right, let's get out of here. I Hi. hate this place. Oh, I don't think it's the place that's meant Bye, to be kid. enjoyed. Take care, hey, kid. kid. One thing. Yeah. You may be the best at what you do. I'm the best at what I do. What let's I make do. sure our paths don't cross badly again, all right? <laughs> you wouldn't be able to catch me, Sheriff. I'm too quick for you. Ba -ba -ba -da 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 -da. <laughs> this is a Mally. You know I'll let him think it. Hi, he's got a lot of learning to do, unfortunately. 